Hello everyone, Delightful here. I like the novel and the new, so today, let's see what the indie world has for me and you. Today it has some Scholar of the Arcane Arts. Now, as I just mentioned on stream, you might imagine that, you know, you're a wizard in this, right? Scholar of the Arcane Arts. Hmm, who does that? Yeah, you're kind of sort of a wizard mage. So, yeah, I'm going to start a new one. A villa, loading in the villa, yeah. So when you spawn, you're like, you're a magic person. And you got these one, two, three, four, five, six. Six chests. Previously, you got like one or two. And then you felt more like an apprentice. Now you do feel like a full-fledged wizard. I'm moving around with WS and D. And I need spells, right? I click tab. I have no spells in my spell book, right? I'm already, I can absorb magic into my mind, but I need the magic, right? Many schools of magic. So currently my, my bonuses, Pyro, Hydro, Geo, Necro, and Aero, right? So Fire, Water, Earth, Death, and Air. So in the most recent build, actually, a whole new dungeon, uh, Necromancy Dungeon, the Crypts, was added, as well as Necromancy, more Necromancy spells. The devs always, the devs pretty active, adding new spells, and it's not just the magic, there are interactions between the magic, right? Guess what? Fire and Water tend not to get along, right? <laughs> you may not have noticed this, you may, perhaps you did. Here you go, I'll tell you right here, to remind me as well. Fire. Fire is cool with earth, because, you know, fire and you, fire can melt stone and create magma, right? And it's strong with death, I guess, the bane fire, you know, when you, you burn a body, <laughs> something like that. But it's weak to water and ice and air, because I guess air can blow it out, I guess? Whereas ice is strong verse fire, what? Strong verse fire, I think is what they mean. Strength. Lesson that's fire and yeah, ice is strong versus fire. The ice puts out the fire because ice and water, right? I was just thinking like in terms of like magic, I like, but fire would melt ice. They mean ice and water. Well, think, let's see what I get. You get two picks. I'd like three picks. I was just talking about fireball, so I need to take the fireball, right? In on stream, I was just because you know you're not a wizard, you can drop the fireball, right? That's, that's a huge power boost. You can just throw a huge bomb and boom. <laughs> But I did say I was going to focus on necromancy, didn't I? It's not normally my thing. I don't normally go for that. I'm just too nasty, you know? You know what's just keeping under those robes, right? Anyway, I haven't messed with these spells. I have messed with Fireball. So Fireball explodes, deals damage depending on your power level, your how strong you are at Pyromancy. And if they're snared or slowed, then Fireball deals double damage. I'm thinking that, like, you've, like, entangled them with greenery or something. Like, yeah, into, like the Entangle spell, which is in Earth, right? Earth and Growth. And you're igniting that and it's burning them. Or, like, you're... You've got them trapped in like in a combustible web, something like that. And they can't move to put out their flesh that burns. Whereas this, this is a touch. Do I actually have to touch? Becomes the question. I kind of like touch range spells from, say, D&D. &D, or Pathfinder 1. Oh, superior system, if I must say so myself. Anyway. Ghastly hand that grasps enemies. Do I have to touch them? And hits for six. It hits weaker than fireball. And I gotta touch them. It has a dot. I'm not a fan of dots. If the enemy is ignited, then the... Okay, so this plays well with this. So I need Fireball. I mean, I want the ranged spell. So I click Fireball and click... So I have a number pad here. The My abilities. 1, 2, 3, 4. And then Q, E, and R. And to cast a spell, I click left mouse button. And then you cast the spell. And it projects the book cleverly. Because it has your spells, right? Has Fireball? Oh, yeah. It'll, it'll repopulate. I'm surprised I didn't do it now. It'll repopulate once they go into a dungeon. Which are all... Randomized. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this, but this is an action roguelike, dungeon crawling, wizard f <laughs> mage focused mm. action roguelike. Now I can get Abyssal Wall. I should probably go for that. Or the Rock Wall. The Rock Wall. Now these are. I'm raising a wall, right? It's a create wall or create wall for fire. But the Rock Wall creates a pill of rock. It can bro block projectiles, right? It can block water, right? Because the earth can absorb the the can absorb the water, right? Or the ice, it can absorb it. And air, right? Because air can't blow down a solid rock, right? And, of course, geomancy spells, but it cannot block pyromancy. So I guess pyromancy can blow through it, or melt it, and necromancy can get through it. Okay, and the abyssal wall. Geomancy, okay, it can block geomancy and aromancy. Necromancy spells cannot block pyromancy. So potentially I could shoot through my own wall. I should go abyssal. So now I click a wall. Now wall spells are cool because you cast them and I can push the middle mouse button. Or put, I can push the middle mouse button. Maybe that one can't. Well, that one I can walk through. Interesting. Maybe that wall's different. We'll play around with that later. Flares or splash? Hmm. I should focus on fire. I gotta focus. Fiery sp sprites. 
Okay, I was thinking spirits from necromancy. We'll charge a random enemy and explode. Okay, more fire. Sorry, it's that. And okay, I mean, it's less directed than I'd like. I can also, if I want, go to tab and then click and drag. I think I want that here. More offensive abilities. That's good. And I can also level up my spells as well. I want to see what I get first. Gaia's shield? This is a shield that rotates me, or a water shield. Hmm. Can block Hydromancy, because I don't want to quit. Hmm. Yeah, and you can get an instant cast as well, so you don't have to worry about a cast time. Note I haven't mentioned mana once. Yeah, because you're not bound by it. It's just cast times. And whatever you can fit in your bar. He's gathering. The, 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 the wizard is gathering ambient mana, right? Hmm. Do I want... I guess I'll take water just to shore up a little bit. And firewall or rock wall? I'll take firewall because I believe firewall can deal damage. And then we'll throw call up on the scythe. I didn't like that spell. I'll throw a rock. That's cool. And we can see see how much damage things do right by seven. Not much. And I throw a rock. Ugh, Twelve. What if I throw flares at them? Ignited. Okay, that's kind of cool. So you can test your build a bit here. I think these are both projectile spells. This channels that'll go there. All right, so let's see. How's this? No. If I were to look at, say, wall of fire, so it's it's an action roguelike, but it's a thinker, right? You do want to be careful planning your build, right? So if I want to look at my. Sp You're not gonna populate my spells, really. You're not gonna. We'll do it later. Can I walk through the wall of flame? So this one. Let me check my commands currently. See if anything has changed. I did a test run on this. It's just. Yeah, 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 yeah. Middle mouse button scroll. That's it, that's it. So, I can scroll and change the orientation of the wall. I was tapping. I'm used to, I prefer tapping. So, wall fire. Very nice. This guy, this person here, can upgrade your spells. That's what you want. So, I want my projectile spells to be fast firing. I can upgrade it for five essence and make it, now, look, look at this. Now, it just occurs. That's huge. And if I can do that twice, I can get some burst damage going. Can I do that with... Here we go, now they're populated. Thank you. Five Essence. Yeah, we want this. Previously, a little rest I did. I wasn't getting spells I wanted to, so I was very dot-focused. I was putting people in bubbles and poisoning them. It didn't feel good. It's not my style. So that's instant. I like that. I can still upgrade it, mind you. Maybe you can't. Cast time, the shield, upgrading it, and the cost time will go down by 1, 0.1 second. Instant cast at 10. Hmm. How about... Abyssal Wall. Cast time. What else do I have? I have this. The shield. We'll upgrade the shield so I can get it. Oh, I can get it. And then, say, the Abyssal Wall as well. So it's cast time's going down a bit. There we go. And there's a city as well. There's. You may have seen it when I went to here. This was added as well. You can upgrade the little town you're in. And I guess there'll be quest board as well. Who wants to build things? A cat, right? And here's where we go in the dungeon, right? So what this means, it's going to be random. The procedural generation begins when I step in there. It could be any of the five elemental themes. Yes, five, because, oh, it's going to be fire. I was hoping it wouldn't be fire, because I've shown fire. Mm, annoying. It's fine. I remember a thing about fire is that I count Another little thing, little bug. The sound effects default to 75 every time. I've re we've tested this like three times. The music volume on the fire zone, from last time I remember, isn't very balanced well, so I had to adjust it. Oh, I was getting buried last time. It's like, I balanced it off the intro and the the initial game, not the... So I'll cut down to about here for fire. You'll see why. Fire zones. And that's actually not good for me. A fire zone and I'm a fire caster. Ugh. Anyway, something that was added, I can hold shift and run. Like, do a short little time displacement. I'm going enemies on around, which is nice. No, what, what? Oh, dragon. Maybe it's a little too low. Maybe. Let me see it. Let me know if it's too low. We'll put it to there, because it can be bombastic. So I took him out, and I get a bit of essence. Are you immune to fire? No, you're not. I imagine they get some kind of resistance to the environment. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, come on, come on. Dodge it. So be quick, right? Choose my shield. Now this should... Ah, see? It eats their shots. And they, they're not master casters like me, so they have to cast spell. Took them out. See? Very cool. So the shield, it orientates towards my direction, and I can fire through it. Very nice. Uh, where's the wall fire? 
They're probably gonna be able to fire through that because they are fire. Oh, but it does deal damage. It's nice. And this one I have to cast. I can move, but I move slowly. See how cool that is? And they're, they're also into... Oh, no, no, no. We don't want any of that. No. Oh, the fire will block fire. I like that. My fire can displace theirs. Oh, those are new. Little health pickups. So there have been interesting updates to the game. Sorry about that. Keep my shield active. Oh, no. Burn you on fire. Or maybe. Yeah, I burned him. Nice. Then. And I can go through my own fire because I'm like, I'm warded against that, right? I'm a, I'm a smart wizard. Can I jack the totem? No. Am I okay with this? Q and E. Q, E. I'll raise my shield, my water shield, which is actually good. So, four. So, I change between them like this, and then if I want to cast it, left mouse button. And I can also... What is it? I can right mouse button and cancel the spell, which is sometimes you might want to do when you're casting up or something like that. You need to move. Mm, let's hold shift and doop. What's that? Can I track with that? Necrotic wall. I look at my spells now, right? Yeah. Why? Why, game? Why? It's very early. I just want to look at them. It's probably because I pulled them off the bar and whatever. Here we go. I just hold them over here. The Abyssal Fumes. Okay. So it's like a they're like caustic gas or whatever. Can block geomancy, aromancy, cannot block pyromancy. So it's a good thing I took a wall of fire, because fire can block fire, right? It absorbs its energy, it blots it out, right? My shield active, which is actually incredibly good. Because this shield blocks fire. If I got a fire shield, that would work too. And necromancy. Eh. Okay, and and okay, you can like can block like. So a water shield can block water, right? It absorbs it or deflects it or transmutes the the ice to water and drips with something like that, you know. There's also click click tab, I get a map here. It's an odd generation. I think I have to go north. Yeah. Woo! Can't walk off the edge, don't worry about that. Yeah, I had to go north. Enemies nearby, where? Hmm. This is a very odd generation. Most odd. I haven't actually found a stuck spot in the whole game. Well, from memory, I haven't. But that might be one. And that is irksome. Can I create like a moving platform I can traverse? If I... That'd be cool. Moving platforms, yeah, that'd be nice. To forestall situations like this. Yeah, I should note that. That's good. That's good. Moving platforms. Yeah. Creating platforms with walls would be cool and help prevent the stuck spots from dungeon gen. Yeah, that'll help. Work some, right? So there's another bug I found. I don't tend to find these things. You just kind of stumble into them, right? I can just... No, I don't want to play the story. I'll see if there's... Maybe there's... It's not a bug way I'm supposed to go this way. That's what it is. I'm supposed to go left. Okay. But it'd be cool if you could make a wall there. And then this would give me alternate means of progression, right? Because it seems like the game's always going to give you a wall spell. Which is cool. Because they're very good defensively. And you also get the, the ward. Necromancy. Wait, wait. That's not a good idea. Oh. You see, it cannot block pyromancy. You see, it actually ignited the... It destroyed the wall. It'd be cool if it, like, ignited it. That'd be cool. No, I'm not leveling up, per se. Right? I'm gaining those. Well, I suppose I am in a way. Like, those are my level ups I use to level up, level up my spells, right? It's like, you're playing Master Magic or something like that. The whole... Or... What's another game that does that? Mm, Age of Wonders Shadow Magic. You have you have your, your mage, who is a hero, right? But they don't level, per se. They level up by researching spells and expanding their control of areas, right? And then you have hero units that actually do level from combat or something, right? Oh, cool. It guided them. Very nice. But you see, it's like, the wizard's all about their spells. Everything else is secondary. He even says that in the, <laughs> the GMG, right? In the player's handbook. They're all about that. That's what they're about. That's their thing. Everything else is completely secondary. Doesn't want me to place it there, huh? Okay. A little too narrow. Boop. Alright, cool. Be cool if you're being chased by something, too. Like, I'm saying, I'm on a plane of elemental fire, right? Say so fire elemental, elementals were arising out of the... The, the ignited ether from down down there and chasing me because I'm in, in foreign interference, right? And they want to steal my magic, right? Or 
gain hold of me because I can breach the planes, right? Things like that, like put like a narrative to it. So I think I'm above, yeah, I'm above and got some, those thingies, which are another means of progression. No, it just looks similar. It's not, hmm, okay. Maybe that is too low, let me see. No, it's fine, maybe they have adjusted the volume, I don't know. You're still where you need to be. Put it to here, 40-ish. Uh, don't forget the chest, it's over here. Here for the magic, F. Ooh, okay, a choice. So I can either heal myself, which I don't need to do, or I take a magic amulet that gives me plus 10 life. So it's an amulet of, um, what would that be? Bear's Endurance, plus two. So it'll give me plus one to con. Ooh, that's the traver That's the head into the, the deeper level. The boss of this... I was hoping it wouldn't be this one. Because the boss of this area is pretty tough. And I want to see a new area. Well, I guess we're playing a bit to see if I can find the necropolis. I've done water extensively, so I wouldn't want to do that again. I might... Uh, if I can restart and force. I know I read the dev notes and that I could throw. And then the next level wouldn't be the same one. So you're not going to stuck, be stuck doing fire. If I die in fire, you'll be back in water or whatever. But I don't want water. I've done a lot of water. Water was the first zone. Air would be good. Earth would be cool. Anything like that. Gimme, 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 gimme. I see there's quite a bit of them now. Uh, let me try see if I can rough them with that. And then see, the walls have their own cooldowns. So this, that necrotic wall is not a good spell for this area, right? I froze them nice. Burn! See, I feel like a wizard. Like I have them firing through my own wall, interrupting their spells by throwing rocks. Very good, very good. Hmm. I see your little Triceratops Dragon Hydra thing. Boom. I believe I can also reduce cooldown. Wait, wait. Maybe I can't. I think you used to be able to reduce cooldowns. Like, you gradually reduce cooldown until it became instant. That changed a bit. Now it's... You just... You, they give you, like, the five. You can instant the projectile spells, which is really good. But the, the cooldown seems to be the same. Oh, no, I think you know, previously it was reducing the, the cast time. Which is, you know, it's how, how it still functions. I think the cooldowns of a thing that will not change. That's the main balance point, I think. Makes me a wall of fire. Protect me. There we go. Thank you. Getting lots of goodies here. I want to drop a chest, or he died on top of a chest. I don't know. Yeah, they dropped chests. That's cool. I like that. Cool if I drop like special reagents, maybe like monster blood or whatever, or fiery heart, something like that. You can go super thematic with it, give like the wizard a voice or something. So, like, they like read a description. I don't know if you want to do like something like that. I don't know. Some people like those sorts of production values, like have the wizard say something and they pick up the heart, or you know. Say little dragon things like Hydra Head or Hydra Eyes. I can make a cool potion with this. I don't know. Something more thematic. Potion crafting. That'd be cool. I can also hold shift. Do it faster. Where do I need to go? Oh, yeah. You can destroy those. I remembered about that. Because I was remembering that you can find odd shaped things underwater when you go to the water zones. It looks like I should be going east, though. Yeah? I'm bringing the layouts of these places. No? Hmm. Okay, this is an optional branch then. Hmm. Yeah, so you see how building, being able to make your own platforms would be really cool. I can hit down. That's down to D2. I do want to get everything. I think I'm supposed to. Yeah, I cleared it. Cool. Let's head down to, I believe this is the solar temple. Sun Temple? Yeah, Sun Temple. First page of the spell book has a map. Yeah, I know that. Thank you. So, Solar Temple's got stronger enemies from memory. Yeah, he, it does. Anything? Were you block? No, you're not block. Okay. So, level two monsters. That's a dragon. Okay. I don't want you to get that off. No. Missed. I'm gonna shoot the wall anyway. Silly dragon. Oh, thank you. The chests are nice. I do like those. Traps? No. There are puzzles in the game too, which I'm not a big fan of, but some people, if you like puzzles, this game has that. 
They're optional. No, that's not the way I wanted it, but that works. See, orientation matters here. <laughs> and we'll scroll up. There we go. I should just tap it. And we'll through here. And very nice. There we go. Bye bye. The healing is a nice addition. It's like your wizards like draining their magical essence and using it to repair their body. I would say like wizards probably, you know, they probably don't heal per se, like you know, drawing on higher holy energy or whatever. They're like using a modified mending cantrip or something, like physically repairing their flesh, which probably feels absolutely lovely, right? Or melting their flesh back together with fire magic or something, ew. Water but probably the most Frozen. Cool, it froze him. How? Oh, the spell throws a rock that explodes on... You died. Throws a rock that explodes on contact with enemies and does six damage. If the enemy so bubbled or frozen... I, want, I think it's because I'm firing through this. That's what it is. Yeah. Okay, that's what it is. So we're seeing a spell combination. So firing through the this is save the little water. That's a spell combo. Putting the, the boulder starting to like a glacial blast or something, which is really cool. It'd be like earth, you'd be like filling your wounds with like, I don't know, bits of like earth or something just to seal it up. Like rub dirt in the wound kind of thing. With stone skin. Orb of power. That seems so cool. Why would I want to give nasty touch when I get orb of power? So what this this does is it strengthens my earth magic, which is cool. I'm throwing rocks. So that'll do more damage. That That's worth it. I got an orb of power. I've got them before, but the game doesn't. I, I did it before the made of progression was a thing, so. Cool. I like that you can walk through your own walls. Previously, I, well, from memory, you couldn't. Okay, we're getting those guys. I remember them. They're tough. So I should... There we go. Freeze them. That's the move. And raise a wall again. There we go. I can hit enemies that are out of sight like that. It's not so effective here, but... It will at least eat one hit, which is nice. I can get this water wall up, which is an actually incredible investment. <laughs> Go over there. And I like this stuff just vacuums to you. We don't, we're not playing a horde survival game. I don't have to, there's no point making me chase things down, right? Because there's no real cost to it. Because I'm pretty much entering every battle, right? At full, almost full resources, not discounting health, but haven't hit yet, so. It's just so interesting critiquing games from one perspective as opposed to another. Ah, I can just wear two amulets. I'm like Mr. T or something. <laughs> I like that. Like, well, who's who are you to say that you know it's, it's culturally insensitive to say that you can only wear one amulet? Who are you to say that, right? Got a little puzzle here. Optional, I think, from memory. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember how to do this. Cool, huh? So you need, you need to use the fire magic to light the thing, but I have to be fast. I don't know if I can do it with firewall. I can. So see, you'd have to be a fire specialist to be able to open it. That's so cool. That's a fun, that's a fun one, right? Maybe a hidden chest. I can get another orb of power, so my geomancer will go up to 15... So it's effectively 100% better than 150% more. Or ethereal form. Leave my body. That's a necromancy thing. Like, yeah, cooldowns are reduced, but it seems like a, a bad idea because then my body's left behind. It's, yeah. I'll take the power. I mean, that, that maybe I'll take that if it comes up again. It's just, it gives me a bit more power, but it's, I'm. I'm not moving me, and you, as you see, you need to be able to move. And that could be kind of frustrating, parking myself down the corner or something, and then trying to 
advance ahead. Mm. Maybe. I'll show you the exact wording for what that is. Can I, yeah, I can hit them through the ice. Nice. I see and that ignites see the, the fire. See, the fire goes faster going through fire, right? Or the projectile, the rock ignites, becomes like a magma bolt or something. I found a new spell. Cool. Let me check this here. Launch two fireballs. I'm, I'm glad I didn't take the other spell because I might not have be able to get this? I don't remember. Oh, that's nice. I like that. I'll move that. Oh, here. Sorry about that. I had to line these things up. We'll try to use that new spell. Uh, say the cast times being slow is frozen. And if I can just, yeah, take him out. Hmm. I'm going to level that one up a bit. It is nice. But it is slow, right? Oh, yuck. Yuck, please aim. There you go, nice. Mm. Sorry about the upset baby. Mm. Oh, they, they see a little drop the walls of fire as well. See, it's eating my, my shots there. Very nice. Those fairies are pretty good. They'll use my own wall of fire against me. Or they'll use their own wall of fire. The same do okay to pick it up eventually. Getting the healing, getting stronger and stronger. Three. Was it three? Ability boosting amulets, HP boosting amulets. Yeah, because I started with 100. Those weren't in the game last time I played, which is nice. I don't know if that's within one progression. I tried to sprint there. Or made a progression, I'm not certain. So ease my way wall of fire. Three and four, if I can hide behind something. Ooh. Um, I didn't mean to load there, but okay. I, I picked up a book, and I opened it, and it teleported me inside a deeper part of a temple. Okay. Not what I was expecting, but all right, fine. Yeah. I'd like a, like a prompt if it's going to do that. I don't know. I mean, completionists wouldn't like missing out on the exploration there. Not a completion, it's not really, but mildly irksome. If I put the this spell through, what happens? Gets a bit stronger. Fire enhances fire, right? Makes sense. If I try to use these spells, the yo, I eat it. <laughs> yeah, very nice. Go take him out. Two wall fires, incredibly good. It's so good. I don't even think it's a basic spell in uh, Pathfinder One anymore isn't 3.5. She's like one of the best fourth level spells you can get. It isn't in Kinmake. Kingmaker, anyway. <laughs> this guy. See, getting that fast would be very nice. Because that's going to eat all... Ooh, fire! Can I trigger that? Oh, look! I can fire my shots through it. Let's see if I can puff it. I think this will puff it. Watch. 
because fire blocks fire, right? So I can hide behind my wall. But what, remember, he can use, was it, water to defeat my fire. Now if I was in water, that fire wall wouldn't be so useful. It would be like my necromancy wall. Oh, necromancy can't block pyromancy or hydro. Whereas firewall has problems with air, which will blow out the fire, and hydromancy to freeze it or wash it away. I'll put it out. Hmm. I'll get you goodies. A lot of goodies. Wow. I think the drop rate on those went up too. Nice. Fields and plains. Oh, ew. So my water damage becomes kind of craptastic. Or I can get a boulder drill. Oh, hmm. 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 I'll take another spell. I'm not that impressed with those fire ones. Because I have like two of this. And pew, 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 pew. It's, uh, they think they have legs. It's cute, but not so much. I think it'll be now Boulder Drill, yeah. And then, see, now, now it's here. And that, that goes back there, yeah. So I can upgrade this. Oh, that's nice. Okay, that's not what I was expecting. So I can create, like, see, interaction here, raise the, the wall, and then, what was it? I create the stone, right? And then orientate the shots through it, and they get, like, a little drill effect. Very nice. Summons a boulder and drill it down for one second. Does one damage, but it skills my geomancy. And geomancy, I've put some points in, right? So that should get stronger. Or I, I can put more points in it, rather, because of all the upgrades. Oh, that's so slow, though. Pew, 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 pew. That's going to be nice at higher levels. Right now, not so much. I wonder if I drop it in the middle. No, it always goes near me and fires in that set direction. Okay. Uh, no, please don't. Don't do that. That's bad. There we go. Boom. See, the wall spells are so well done, this. To, like, just an uncapped wizard. Ooh, thank you for the goodies. Which I'm automatically distilling into some sort of capsule, like, magic pill <laughs> I'm taking, I guess, or I give to somebody. I'm their supplier, right, for the magic goodies. That's kind of cool. I don't know if anyone's played with that before. Magic is, is drugs. As a, as a performance enhancer. I can't remember what setting that's done that. I mean, because it literally is, right? Maybe it affects your mind, too. Be cool. See how instant casting is just so good. Make sure I'm recording. I tend to lose track of time playing this game. More piles of magic pills. And again, the wizard is like totally an addict, right? Can't get enough of the stuff. Swag's in here. Learn more magic. And the fire mages are mad. The fire mentals are mad. This, this attic mage is coming in and stealing all their good stuff. It's unnatural, right? Fire belongs in the fire. Not in books. It's weird. Fire burns books. You can see how fire mentals point out. I mean, I like the wizard. That's cool. I don't remember this thing. I don't remember this thing at all. Might be a puzzle, though. Enemies nearby where? Tried to sprint up north. Uh, what does it do? Oh no, it's a puzzle. <laughs> I don't know. No thank you. Not my thing. But it's there if you want it. I don't want it. Freeze, like a little crowd control there. And I can't ignite him when he's frozen, which I think is a nice touch, right? But I, I guess I can just scorch a hole in the ice. Doesn't just put it out. No, I don't have a melee attack, right? You can kind of get this a necromancy spell that kind of sort of does like an AoE around you, but it summons a scythe. That's about the closest I've seen that weird necro touch thing, but I'm loving elementals. Energy, why would I want to play around with the bad touch, you know? He's not into that. He's a nice wizard. He doesn't do the bad touch. Give me those. Can I like that? No, I just break it. <laughs> that works too. See level three is now? Because I'm in dungeon level 3, right? Throw this rock at you. Uh, because you move half people casting. Beep, 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 beep. I mean, that could be something later. Like, I need to, like... I think the way to use that would be to put it behind a wall, and then put it here, and then each shot's gonna be amplified. Right? See? That's how you use it. On cooldown. It's right there. Get him. 
No, what'd you find that way? Whatever. Must have saw something over there. Very cool. What are those with block shots for you? Could have. Yeah, I think they have collision, so I guess so. That's cool. My spells shoot through it, but maybe lesser magic spells can't, yeah? That'd be cool. Oh, you gotta heal out of these guys. Oh, they're protectors. That's what they do. See? see? She's being... Oh, okay. Thank God for my... Oh, he's dead. See, she's being protected, so I have to pull her out. Pull away from that channeler. Hmm. There we go. The ward's dropped. See? She's still up. She is. So you got a little bit of a wizard battle there. Mage battle. This guy. Was that the channeler? Might have been. Yes, he is. He's pretty cool, huh? Got his own wall fire. So you will block my stuff. Very effectively, actually. Yeah. <laughs> See, you can mess me up. There you go. Got him. Give me that. Okay. Let's give a spray in igniting them, isn't it? She can't hit me from there. No. Mm -mm. Too slow. Yeah, sorry about that. Babies get what they want. <laughs> they do. So I wanted to show this. So when you cast the spell, right, you move slower, right? But once it's prepared, your book is ready. It doesn't slow you down anymore. So you can pre preload a, a lengthy spell to cast, and you can just drop it. Oh, this guy. I forgot about these guys. So once I pass these guys, it's boss time. Yeah. Hmm. So we've got a little upgrade station here. She'll let you upgrade your spells, so right before the boss. Some temple, very few windows. Yeah, 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 I know. So I want to... Let's see. Do they both use... Yeah, the, these things. I can upgrade this. See, the last... It's expensive, but that's worth it. Now it's instantly up. That's a big deal. That's a huge power boost for me. Now, do I want instant cast at 15? So, you see, 
leveling up my what was it spell lore is what they called it what they call it yeah geo hmm it's not reflecting there maybe it, yeah max level it's the max level there raising that means i can upgrade my spells more that's what that is it moves a cap uh, so then i can't put any more in that not through this system anyway but those you cannot remember so at 15, I could get this to 15 and instant cast that. Isn't that good though? Yeah. I think wall fire is what I want. That'll instant cast at 10, so boop, 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 boop. Pricey, but worth it, because that's that's so good. Boom. That's power there. Look at that. Boom and boom boom. Look at that. So powerful. Now what about this? 15. Can I get to 15? I can not. I didn't get a fire boost to it. I got geomancy boost. What do you do? I can break down. Okay, you break down the power. See, this is the one, the power stone lady. Yeah, they break down the power stones to increase the power level of your spells. Okay, okay. That's right. That's right. So I can. It will do more damage. That's nice. This will last. Damage per gel doesn't go up enough for here. You see, has to do with the cost is going up. Hmm. Worth it, I think, though. So, how much do I dump in this to get this worthwhile? Two. Mm. There we go. See, the power stones are a thing. They are impactful. Block higher level spells, but I usually can't do it because I guess my hydromancy limit has been met or reached. Your max level's five. Yeah. Ouch. I haven't boosted it, maybe? Hmm. So I see this is the using those shards there. Can I I think I should see if I can make that that rock spell instant, huh? It is getting expensive. Just short. Oh, that's unfortunate. Almost there though. So short cast. Nice. And then we might as well see if we can make it better. Gets to three. Compile level seven. Cool. We'll just push for the boss. I mean, if he beats me, it'll be an unsatisfying short video, won't it? Let's see. Demigod Siren, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Okay, well, I can get myself situated here. Maybe I can do that instantly. I am a lot stronger now. Oh, there's a thing with him. Oh, oh, that's instant now. I'm like, why is it working? It's instant, man. You forgot. You get so used to a thing. You get your upgrades and like, oh, um, yeah, I already got them. His whole thing before was that he, he can heal. I think last time I was fighting this, so I had a water barrier, which wasn't very helpful, as you can imagine, right? That's so good being instant. Something else, you can also have multiple walls. Oh, I have to... Oh yeah, he's what is he doing? He hit me. Ouch. Yeah, he summons critters. Yeah, and that can be an issue. One of them heals him, I think. Well, he teleports too. You know, don't step on the. Okay, change the orientation there. Okay, he's a big version of the other guy. You start dumping fire onto him. I raise my ward there. I like to layer the fire as well, just in case. He might eventually shoot through. Where'd he go? Oh, very nice, very nice. Why not teleport spell myself? Yeah, he's not so bad. Well, he's tanky as all hell, but he's manageable. Oh, what do you do? Is he at his healing phase now? 
Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, he summons a meteor. I forgot. Oh, oh, I have to shoot the meteor, right? Oh, no. I forgot about that. Okay. Whew, I got it. I forgot about that. That's what he does. That's his thing. He likes to do that. Oh, yeah. He like, yeah he, he'll die for me, too. Where is he? He's coming here. Oh, no. Do I need that? I need that to go off. Oh. See, so it's important to upgrade your spells. Where's he going? He's going to come down here. Uh, get my, my spells off quickly. There we go. It kind of makes sense that I'm much faster than him. Because he's got, like, he's huge, right? So he has, like, less coordination than I do. I like that. He's ignited. Like that. Really? Frozen. Where's my ward? Pick up the ad. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, he's there. Okay. So it's pretty intense. Uh, what's he gonna do now? Has he decided he's not gonna attack me anymore? There he is, he's over there. Oh, he's calling the meteor, see? So you have to get ready for... Oh, he's doing a volley. I mean, the meteor has like a little bit of a... cooldown before it shows up. Oh, there it is. I need this to go off. Ooh. That's a DPS check, isn't it? <laughs> no, he's about to drop. Take that. Ooh, very nice. And he dropped a nice HP increase. Orb of power. Water rushes on the beam to hit four enemies. And I'll focus on Geomancy. And I'll take a spell in here if I get it. Ooh, Dragon Shield. Project you from your projectiles. So project you from projectiles. Hmm. Well, I could push my Hydromancy. Hmm. I cannot block. Hmm. Because I already have a Water Shield, right? I'll take the Orb of Power. Fun, right? Let's see, this is going to take me. Back to my villa, I guess. Okay, so I'm a lot stronger now. A lot stronger. Beep, 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 beep. So now I can go to this guy. Hey, remember me? Yeah, I remember you. I'm going to upgrade this, so now it's instant. That's huge. So, note the cooldowns have not been modified, see? Oh, that's huge. Then as long as I put a wall between it, the damage will go up massively. Oh, it gradually erodes. That's so cool. And then I go... That's 40, um, that's, oh my god. That's 80 damage. Or fireball can 10. Or 10. Yeah, that, that's a huge spell. Don't sleep on that one. Like, you just cast it here. Big difference. Big difference. Uh, hmm. But the same, actually. But it was also igniting them. I don't think it was counting the, the ignition damage. Why are you fine over there? Why are you doing that? What are you doing that for? That's cool how it erodes. Don't know why it's doing that. But yeah, it'll ignite things, which is pretty cool. And I got some more of those crystal thingies. Make that deal 4 damage per drill. Make that deal for 11. Hmm. Block higher level spells, increases health pretty much. Can block higher level spells. Power flares. I mean, eventually I might out level fireball. Like, can I ever get pyromance? What is that? Saron's barrage. Can I ever get that higher level? Maybe. Hmm. Casting level 15. Can I get there? Becomes the question. <laughs> Sorry. 
No, I can't get there. I just geomancy I can get there. Hmm. Anyway, this is a pretty good length for one video, I think. This is Skull of the Arcane Arts. And I'm going to play some more. So I have to put a break in these videos so they don't become too unwieldy. See what the next dungeon is going to be. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Bye.